ori la babo abafori sasile. No, there is no expression such as this in the Yoruba tradition. Instead, what we have is ori la babo kato bosa. This expression foregrounds the closeness of your ori to you more than any other thing. In fact, it is believed that before any orisha can grant your request, your ori must have granted that request first. Hence, your ori must first say yes before an orisha can say yes. The importance of the ori is foregrounded inside Oduifa Ogunda Meji. Now, in this Odu, we have a man named Alasan. He needed to travel to Okun. Okun is a place that is very significant to the destiny of Alasan. Hence, he needed somebody to escort him. They therefore asked, who is qualified to escort Alasa to Okun? Shango came out and said he was qualified to escort Alasa to Okun. But unfortunately, after some inquiries, Shango discovered that he was not qualified to escort Alasa. In the same vein, Oya came out and said she was qualified to escort Alasa. Oya also discovered after some inquiries that she could not escort Alasan. After this, Osala came out and said he was qualified, but just like Shango and Oya, he discovered that he was not qualified to escort Alasan. Then we have the mighty Elegbara who said he was qualified, but at the end of the day, just like others, he discovered that he could not escort Alasan to Okun. Then we have the powerful Ogun. Ogun said he was qualified, but unfortunately, he also could not escort Alasa. Finally, we have the mighty or Romila Bara Bitu Bara Ele Sionya. He said he was qualified to escort Alasa, but after some inquiries, he also discovered that he was not qualified to escort Alasa. Everything then seemed like a dead end for Alasa because he could not go alone. They then asked Oromila, who is then qualified? to escort Alasa to Okun. Then Oromila said, Ori, Ori ni kan lo talasa anbar Okun bèni. Oni, bimo ba lo wola ye. Ori ni won rofun, bimo ba bimo la ye. Ori ni won rofun, ire gbogbo ti mo ba ni la ye. Ori ni won rofun, koso osa ti da ni igbe, lenye ori eni. This therefore shows the need to propitiate the Ori before any Orisha. Ori lao babo kato bosa. But the question now is, why were the other Orisha not qualified to escort Alasa to Okun? We shall be discussing this in the next video. I hope you have learned one or two things. I'll see you some other time. Ire.